What's going on guys, Bobby here, and today we got back to like the original type of videos. Now we haven't done this in a while, just playing on a map, showing you guys what comp is super good, and showing you guys basically how to win and gain trophies on that map. So today we are on Bridge Too Far, there's still about 6 hours left. Uh, when the time of this video drops, it's probably only going to be 3 hours left, but it comes up in rotation fairly often, so you guys will be able to know how to play this map. Now there's about 6 brawlers that are really good here, and that goes like Brock, Rico, Bo, Pam, Piper... Carl and I guess you can throw a Colt in there so there's like seven but I would say this comp is by far the best one now let me tell you why I think Brock is the best lane I don't think you can go wrong with Brock whether you're on the side or the mid Bo is super defensive and really good for holding down the pressure and then the Rico is really good at taking out triple tank which you will see like once every 10 times on this map or like a Pam for example or just a singular tank if someone's running a little bit off meta so I definitely definitely recommend running a Rico or a Colt I prefer Rico because I enjoy the bounce shots so let's hop into these games and let's see if we can go on a win streak so let's hop right into that first one now okay so here we go into the first game we're gonna be facing so triple range triple very slim comps it's gonna be a Colt a Piper and a Brock now Rico isn't the best in the middle but I think that's where we're going to go this game because there's two of them over here. So we're able to take them out fairly easily as well as we're going to see if we can help Dylan over here when it's late. I'm not able to hit the shot. Oh, Dylan, no. Let's give him an auto wave. But Dylan is going to be able to take him out. There isn't too much area to juke over here. Oh, did I just kill both of them? Oh, wow. I was able to get two kills right there. Let's see if I can charge my super by hitting that Colt. I was able to do so. So we're just going to back up. Wait for them to get in. And just hit him with another clip. So that's why I love using Rico. I love being able to clip the safe. And them at the same time. So it's just charging your super again. And you can just continuously do it. So I'm just going to back up and heal up. Because I'm one shot to a Brock and to a, uh, and to a Piper. Fortunately, I reacted a little bit late over there. So the Brock was able to get some hits. I'm going to get the super off over here. And hopefully be able to kill the Brock. The super wasn't able to do so. But I was able to end up finishing off the Brock. The Piper is going to be right over here. And we definitely don't want to be hit by this Piper. Oh, this is not looking good for their Brock. Yeah, he's just going to go down. So we have a lead over here. We're doing a lot of work. Let's see if we can get that Piper. We were able to get the Piper and the safe over there. So we're just going to continuously chip down at it. We were able to get the Brock alongside our bow. You guys can see how useful the bow is at keeping possession. As I said, you know, he's not high DPS, but once you have control, he's super good. So that's going to be the end of the first game. We are able to get a quick dub, and I was able to get star player with that dominant mid control. Let's see if we can continue doing this in the second game. So here we go into the second game, and now we're facing a little bit more of a buff comp as they subbed out the Piper for that uh, for that Pam. Dildo is going to be running... <laughs> uh, that's a funny name to say. Um, he's going to be running um, a Carl instead of what he had originally. Just because I think he's he hasn't played this map too much, and he's trying to uh, see all the lanes and see what he likes the best. So I'm going to see if I can finish off that Colt so we can help him win lane since he lost it. It looks like this Brock is fairly low. We're only going to have to hit him once. Oh, but Rocky is going to steal our kill. Just going to aim down over here. Hopefully we get that super off. Wow, I focused on the Pam a bit too much, and the Colt is going to be able to take us down. Hopefully our Piper can get a snipe on, her, on him. Yeah, there we go. So Pam over here. Yeah, the Pam is going to be in the middle. So we're just going to focus on clipping this Pam over here. Just going to heal up. Let the Pam keep shooting. We have the Colt in the middle. Now, good thing that we're in the middle, not the Piper, because we have that piercing ability with our super. So we're going to be able to get the Pam likely here. Oh, one more shot. That's unreal. Anyways, it's a close game right now. Oh, the Piers were on Brawl TV. I didn't even notice that. Going to be able to get a pretty easy kill over there on the Pam. Hopefully, I can help out with the Brock. He was able to get him to one shot. The Colt is going to attempt to super us, but we're going to be able to juke it out of the way on that one. So let's see, so they have a 1% lead right now. The Pam is going to put out the turret. I'm going to be able to hit the safe over there in a little bit of the Pam. I'm going to go down over there. I was going to go for the bounce shot, but I don't think that was the play over there. So we have a 10% lead. This is definitely a good game over here. We're able to take out the uh, Pam alongside Rocky. Let's even get that Brock. Don't want to get hit by the Brock because we're both one shot. Ugh. All right, so we went down uh, over here. They have a big push coming for sure. I was able to hit most of my super. Okay, so they do have a fairly decently sized lead now. So we're going to have to get a solid comeback in order to get this dub. 
I'm gonna see if I can help out Rocky. Made the Colt one shot for him. I'm gonna get a super down over here. Gonna be able to get that Pamlo, but I am going to have to regen. If I go down, it's unlikely that I'm gonna be able to move up. So I cannot die no matter what. Good kills over there by Rocky. Looks like Dylan is actually going off on the save, so we're gonna be able to shoot it over here. And to be honest, this is looking like a dub for us. I, I don't know exactly what happened, but I'm assuming it was some sort of crazy play by Dylan. Oh, we got it to 1%. Yeah, but I'm assuming it was some crazy play by Dylan, but all because all of a sudden we had control and we were able to win the game. So really good play over there by Dylan. That's our second star player. GG's to them. Let's hop into that third game. So here we go into the third game and they're going to be going with a Brock, a Bow, and a Piper. Now this is probably the worst comp that you can face as a Rico because there's not much that you can do towards the other guys and they slightly outrange you for the most part. So this one's definitely going to be a little bit tougher. So I'm one shot to the Piper so I'm just going to stand behind this barrel for now. Piper's coming back out. Looks like the Brock's being able to get us. Oh boy, we got pinched over there by the Brock and the Piper. Not much, not many places for us to go. I think I'm going to end up going on the left over here, just because I think we're going to have an easier time with the bow. Oh my god, the bow got saved by the Piper. Yeah, this is really not looking good for us right now. I'm just going to have to go up with my super. I was able to get a lot of good shots over there on the pipe. Oh my god. Piper is able to take us out. Okay, so we are able to move up the map over here. I'm not going to allow it to get any more shots. We're just going to body block. Good jukes over there by the Piper. Alright, double body block and we're able to finally get that lane win. Now the bow is going to put some lines in the middle, so we're just going to take our time to explode those right now. The Piper is coming up here though. Gonna go into a little bit of a hiding position, still trying to find those mines. Gonna super the safe over there, but we are now one shot to the Piper. We are able to trade, and that's not bad regarding the situation we are in, so that's pretty good. So now we're only down 9%, that's pretty good from where we started. We do have the Brock and the Piper sort of around the middle now, which I definitely don't like. I was caught up there because the Brock was super in the safe, so I couldn't move back or else I'd go into the Brock shot. I have to start focusing the Piper more because I'm just getting absolutely tapped by him. Looks like Rocky was able to take him down, so I'm going to go on the Brock lane and see what happens here. Dylan almost got the kill over there. I'm going to be able to take out that Brock. This Piper really has it made out for me, man. Wow. You will not leave me alone. So Piper is just going to jump right over here. So we're going to... Oh, auto aim. Did not work over there. So we are able to take him out. The Brock is in the middle. So we only have 30 seconds. Now Rocky's going to super the safe. Oh, the Piper is coming back with a vengeance over here. All right. We're able to juke one shot. Dylan looks like he's going in. I'm going to move towards the middle now. Get that super off. Don't want to die to the Piper. All right, we're able to get the kill. So we're down 4% with 9 seconds left. Just going to heal up a little bit. Just going to shoot the save. Oh, I was able to get just enough percentage. There we go. We got the 7% win. Wow, what a comeback we had on them. Really good play by Rocky and Dylan over there. They kind of carried a little bit because I did not play well against that Piper. So GG's to them. Let's get on to that fourth game and let's see if we can go to 4-0. So here we go into the fourth game. Now we're facing some heist pros, though, I want to say. They're running a little bit off meta over here, which is pretty interesting. But they're definitely super good at heist. They basically one-trick this mode, so this is definitely going to be a tougher game than the other ones, even though they are running off meta brawlers. We're able to win lane fairly easily so far. I'm just going to shoot the save to start off. So we already have 15% done. It looks like Rocky's going to super the save. So we have 39% done already, which is super, super good. We're going to keep our distance from that mic because that is going to be what's going to take us down a lot of damage. It looks like we went up a little bit too far. I was, I am going to miss the super over there. Let's get out of the way. Oh, that explosive damage got us. Wow. So we already have 50% done though, which is super, super good. So that's a great start by us. I'm going to be able to get that Brock over there. I'm just going to move up and hit that safe. I'm probably going to be hit by this over here. Yeah. There's not many places I can go because of this mine thing. I can't, I basically can't juke. I have to walk in one direction because of that turret. Let's see what the Brock does. I think I'm just going to go with the super. Yeah, I'm going to be able to take out the Brock along with Ibra, along with Rocky. I was going to take that out because it's going to make it impossible for us to juke. Oh, it was able to hit us. No way. 
All right, so we're gonna back up. We already have 65% done compared to the 0% that they have done. So we have a pretty good lead so far. We're not in the best spot right now though. Oh, I messed up that one. Hopefully he's able to get him. There we go. Yeah, this turret is the only, or this border is basically the only thing that's getting in our way for the most part. But it looks like Rocky was able to get rid of it. So that's definitely super good for us and for us to move up. Although their penny does have one again. I'm really missing those ground shots so far. Okay, but we're able to move up. I'm on this safe now. Oh my god. Again, not much for room for us to juke over here. The mic is going to spawn. I'm just going to back up. Oh, we got him to one shot. 140 health. Although it is looking really good. I don't see them doing even close to enough damage as they have to in order to win this game. So I think we're in a really good spot right now. Their penny is going to come onto our lane as well as we're going to get supered. But Dylan is just going to literally Carl super up the map and rush it as fast as he can. He's going to aim my super here and be able to take out the penny. Oh, we haven't taken it out yet. Yeah, there we go. So we took out the penny. Looks like Dylan's on the safe. He's probably going to be able to end it. There we go. And that is going to be the end of the fourth game. So we're going to play one more game. Hopefully we can get a really good comp or even face triple tanks. That would be super fun. But anyways, let's hop into that fifth one and let's see if we can go 5-0. So here we go into our final game, and we're going to be facing a super annoying comp of the Double Range and Crow. Now let's see what ends up being in the middle. It's probably going to be the Brock or Piper. Oh, never mind. It is the Crow. I've never seen a Crow mid before. Um, I, I, I personally just hate facing a Crow. It's, I find it the most annoying thing in the world. But we are able to take it out over there. I'm going to get a few shots off on the safe, and while we reload our ammo, we're also going to be able to regen our health now we're just going to keep our distance from the crow because we do have a couple tiles on it so if we're able just to stay back and chip it away oh god that piper just the piper just said no to our plans over there it just absolutely refused let's see if we can get that super off there we go we are able to take out the crow with our super dylan should be able to take out that piper yes he's going to be able to do so so i'm just going to chip away at the safe the Brock looks like he wants to come on our lane right now, so we are one shot to him. So when you are one shot to your lane, you're just going to want to back up. Because dying is the worst thing that you can possibly do. Anyways, we're going to be able to kill that Brock. This game is looking like it's going to be a fairly quick win. We're just going to get a couple more shots on the save, and that is going to be it in one minute. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We went 5-0 today, and we played Rico. I know you guys love watching us play Rico. Like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, that's going to be it for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will catch you later. Peace.